guys you are welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you very much for always coming out here please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you have not thank you very much once again may god bless you all a popular islamic cleric sheikh ahmed gumi recently took to his facebook page to condemn the gruesome murder of fatima and her three children by ipop linked unknown gunmen in anambra state gumi said IPOP, unknown gunmen, massacre of innocent people by denouncing extra judicial killings for whatever reason from whoever, the government or individuals or groups. We have now the moral high ground to condemn this heinous crime committed by these savages and barbarians under the guise of tribalism. Hala is enough. Hala is enough for this. In the early days of kidnappings of foreigners in the Niger Delta, many of the people from their faith were. It is foreigners they were kidnapping. There is nothing that we make that we make them start kidnapping indigenous and Nigerians. Well, the rest they say is history. For those still defending the arts and activities of terrorist in your region defending and rationalizing the art of murderers and cold-blooded killers their calamities will soon ripe and you shall reap for reap what you are watering and fertilizing meanwhile nothing has left those places as soon as they can safety first please their life matters truck drivers of northern origin should also six moments to those states for now some of them are resident in lagos and even the north wise striking and rationalizing the activities of terrorists in your state targeting helpless and innocent people shaik gumi said has the police caught the culprit why concluded its ipop why single out this poor woman and her children? It will never be well with those criminals. Let there be thorough investigations and the perpetrators brought to book. Come to think of it. How did you get to conclusion that IPOP committed a said crime? Meanwhile, in as much as we condemn the happenings in the East, I still want us to be realistic in our judgment. The picture of the slain Anambra lawmaker went viral, likewise Deborah's case. Why nothing like that is in the said case and the northerners are foaming? Or is it this another poly by some people to tarnish IPOB? Hmm, these are reactions by Nigerians. This Gumi is a terrorist and very tribalistic. Without getting the facts and establishing the truth, he has started lively and putting the crime on IPOB. What a dark-minded shaykh gumi, full, full of hate. On those who are not Muslims, the reward will come to you. We have terrorists in the north and terrorists in the east. So, accept the fact even a blind man can see. Even his generation are all terrorists. Ask him how many people he killed. But to kill by Igbo is nothing. But other evil like then, Ki, is an offense. Useless, outcast, smelling demon. Okay, guys, these are reactions by Nigerians. Honestly, we have to condemn this. This is really very bad. Killing is bad understand whether it uh, the killing was done by a northerner or a southerner killing is bad you nobody have the right you know to take life you you cannot give you understand but at the same time we have to be very careful in our judgment because so many strange things are happening right now in the north in the southeast i beg your pardon and whatever that happens is being tagged on the IPOP members. 
the truth is that the ipod members too <laughs> they themselves are not happy with what is going on because everything that is happening right now in the south is you know they will be called because they are agitating for you know for freedom honestly this is bad though very very condemnable killing a pregnant woman and her children is bad we have to condemn it like what has like what i said before we have to be very careful with our statement we have to be very careful with what we say no investigation has been done to actually you know ascertain that it was ipod members that committed the crimes if we continue like this there's going to be a, a religion fright or yeah yes what would just bust out because the northerners will be feeling that the southeasterners do not want them to be in the southeast already they are asking uh, northerners to leave the southeast so what else again that means wahala don't start with this but it is not hard to go about this okay let them find out those who are killing people in the southeast i've said this thing before now and i will continue to say it the southeast leaders make kuna wake up oh. these people when they keep people then go so come from ahead if you don't wake up these people want to bring down the southeast region not be the time to talk too much this is the time of taking action okay someone said yeah, the killing and the burning of Igbo's shop at abuja is never a subject matter and you as mr gumi never heard or saw it on social media all these whom whom their shop was burnt and killed are not human being play justice with sincerity keep inside aside this it no life is common nigeria's are suffering because of ethnic city and tribalism okay guys i will drop it here kindly share your thoughts below the comment section please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you have not thank you very much once again may god bless you all bye for now